All right, in this video, I'm going to show your facility uh, inside Emacs, which is nothing but uh, but to edit file with a pseudo privilege in a directory where you require a super user privilege to edit file, uh, probably in a etc file or some other file where the where the normal user require some sort of elevated privilege so emacs has a different mechanism to do that in this specific video i'll show you a package which i have been using called pseudo edit okay so you can get it from from the uh, repository you have so i have bounded the key with the, with just to call it uh, easily so so the package name is sudo hyphen edit which will allow you to edit a file which require elevated permission okay so without further ado let me get into my max say for instance i wanted to open i'm just trying to open an arbitrary file just for the demonstration purpose so let me open something. Um, no, do, wait, I'm, I'm just trying to look out for a file, okay? So this is a file and uh, if i want to make us make some changes say for instance see uh look at the bottom of the screen i cannot do anything because the buffer is read only because it's in a it's in a folder where you you're supposed to have a elevated privilege to edit the file in that folder in this case i'm in it zip folder it could happen to other folder too where you are not having the proper permission to edit the file so like in terminal we do sudo and the file here it is in emacs i'm taking advantage of a package called sudo hyphen edit to make the editing i have bounded a key Control c s e look at the bottom of the file but it is asking me for the pseudo password. So if I give the password, now it is saying auto save file on local temporary directory. Do you want to continue? If I say yes. Now if I go here and if I write, it is now write is now activated. Now I can save it okay with the, it's a simple pseudo mechanism which elevate the privilege here inside emacs a uh, lot of people do with tramp tramp is a big package and i probably will do a video on that later if i get a chance and inclination but this is the simplest possible package you can get it from your repository i mean emacs repository not from your os repository okay so if you get it you can you can install it and just bind a key like like what i did okay so it is in brief allow edit file in a directory where the files require an elevated privilege simple okay so i hope this small stuff will make things much easier to to get on with the max so give yourself a chance to do better thing so try it out if if you don't like the simplest interface or something more complicated or something else go for it I use it personally that's why I'm making this video okay you are not supposed to use it if you don't like it 
as simple as that okay so i hope this will be useful to some people thanks for watching